also on your USB you have pattern papers and as I said at the beginning you can't these won't open on your scan and cut these need to be plugged into your computer or directly into your printer if you've got a fancy printer and printed off but we've given you ombre colors so your doily will ombre out as if you've inked it but we've also given you these beautiful pattern papers now I'm gonna, not going to flick through all of them because I think it's nice to have a surprise but you will see that they're almost in little families so we've got just the irises the irises smaller the irises with butterflies then the rose with the butterflies etc etc different styles for each one so you might use that for your background and then another one for the center of your doily etc I wouldn't necessarily cut doilies out of this and I wouldn't necessarily put this behind a doily unless you're using black because it's going to go a little bit it's going to kind of blend into each other but if you're doing layers of your doilies so solid centers this would work perfectly to add in that detail so I'm just going to really whiz through these so you can get a look and feel if you are somebody that loves rice paper that likes the idea of mixed media or somebody that's got a printer that won't take rice paper this is your perfect option so you've got these beautifully designed papers that you can then use in all of your I mean that just in a frame would look exquisite so maybe you take a rectangle doily frame and you put that around the edge of that and you put it on your wall this isn't about just for the doilies this is about giving you beautiful papers that you can use for all sorts of different things so you've got all these fabulous fabulous patterns and papers and images that you can use upside down of course it is Where's upside down? like this and then we go back to the beginning so they've duplicated some of these just exquisitely beautiful and as I said I don't want to show you each one because it's nice to have a little surprise so I would open those up as thumbnails on your computer have a look through decide which ones you want to use and away you go